Hello YouTubers, welcome to TechPost and in today's video, I will show you how to unlock Windows PC using the fingerprint scanner of your Android device. At this time, I can't tell you much about how safe it is, but I can tell you it's fun and you can always show off your skills to your friends. So if you want to learn something new every day, please subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. This will support us and help us create more content for you people. So hit that red subscribe button now and keep watching Tech Post Guides. Now guys, why don't you like my videos if they work for you? Please, it's important, hit like if it works for you. So let's start with the tutorial and uh, we will start with installing the unified remote server application. Now some of you might know about this tool, it's about 35 MB. Also install the Android app of unified remote on your Android phone. The link are given in the description. Now that we have installed unified remote server on our PC, it's time to set up our Android device. So for that, we need an app called Tasker. So the link is again given in the description. Now to make it more easier, I have already exported the XML file for you guys. So open the Tasker app and then tap and hold on task tab. Now tap on import and then import the fingerprint unlock.xml file that you have downloaded which contains all the settings. Now tap on it and tap again on unknown plugin. Now tap ok to install the auto tools app from the play store. It's free to download but uh, to use it you have to purchase license. The trial version is available for 30 days only. So for now you can activate the trial version. Select your google play account to activate the trial. That's it. Now go back to the Tasker app and tap on fingerprint unlock again. Now this time we need to make some very important changes to all tasks. So first we will start with the action tools text. So tap on it. It's the second entry and then tap on the pencil icon to edit it. Scroll down, tap on encryption and under encrypt or decrypt option choose decrypt. Now tap on the password and change it. Just remember this password, we will need this later on. So I'll enter here 54328. Now next go back and make a small but very important change in the URLs. We need to add our Windows PC or the laptop name by replacing MMR at the end of the URL. So remove MMR and write your PC name there. You can check the PC name under system properties and similarly you have to replace the MMR with PC name in other two URLs also. Now that's it. Now go back to the task tab and click on plus button to add a new task. Now you can name it anything. For example, I'm naming it a finger. Now next inside finger task, we need to add actions. So tap on plus button and select variables. Then tap on variable set and in the name field type encrypted password and under to field type percentile pass. Now go back, tap again on the plus button and this time click on plugin. Now tap on auto tools, scroll and select text. Now added the auto tools text by tapping on pencil icon. Tap on text and type percentile pass. Then look for the encryption and, and inside encryption tap on encrypt or decrypt and select encrypt this time. Now tap on password and enter the password that we chose while editing finger unlock task that is 54328. Now go back and finally add one more action. So tap on the plus button, choose variables and variable set. This time enter pass in the name field. And in to field, enter the password of your Windows PC. Remember if you are using the password, enter the password, but if you are using the pin like me to log in to your PC, enter the pin here. That's it. Now just move this to top and run the task by tapping on the play button. 
If you see green dots on all three actions, this means task executed successfully. Now go back and delete the finger task as we don't need it anymore. Now go to the fingerprint unlock task and add an icon to our task so that we can create and add task a widget to home screen. So select the appropriate icon and exit the app. Now on the home screen, add widget by selecting tasker and then tap on task and under task, choose fingerprint unlock. It will open the fingerprint unlock actions tab, but uh, just exit it. You will notice that the task icon on your home screen is already added. So that's all we need to do in order to use our Android device as a fingerprint scanner for our Windows PC. So let me show you a quick demo. Just turn on your PC and then unlock your Android device. Tap on the task of widget that we created. Uh, it will ask you to scan your finger. So just put on your finger on the sensor and uh, you will see that your Windows PC has been logged in successfully without tapping a single key. So this can be done remotely also and only thing that you need is internet connection. So go ahead, set it up and enjoy. Make sure to subscribe and share this video. Give this video a thumbs up. If you liked it, leave your questions, suggestions and feedbacks in the comment section. I will be back with a new coolest video soon. Thanks for watching guys. Have a great time.